Welcome to Roots TV. We are here game week 9 for the Bandai edition. I'm sitting here with Gaurav Asmo, the owner and player for Life Blues FC, OCF. Mohamed Ali, the owner for Mumbai Superheroes. Miss, the lovely Miss Natasha Dessa, his supporter. And of course, Anthony Pecorino for Life Blues. Is that how you really think you say my name? No, 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 Lightpool is currently at 10 points, Superheroes at 11 points. It's a crucial game for both teams to win it or lose it. Gaurav, talk to us. Yeah, look, uh, we drew 0 0 in the first game we were playing against each other. We didn't have Pex. Uh, hoping to obviously build from the back, and with Pex, I think, look, very simply, Ahmed Ali. We yet to lose a game with uh, Anthony. I have only played two. Well, it doesn't matter how many he's played, he's got 100% record. So we want to continue that. No doubt it's a tough game, man. These guys have some good players. Jordi, Seb. Uh, so yeah. who do you think from their team that's particularly shut down for this upcoming game? It's very simple. It's, it, for me, it's Jordi and Sebastian, two-man team. Shut that down. I don't think the service comes up. And do you think having Pex on your side obviously is going to be a massive advantage because he controls the game from the middle for you guys? So. I mean, look, we've lacked goals this season. We know we have. And Pex is that man who can either create or score. Right. Uh, but I know for a fact that Mohamed Ali's team is well drilled. They're fucking a very good team. Right. And uh, I know they're going to come all guns blazing. And they've got some good talent in their team, no doubt. Mohamed, what do you think? I think uh, to handle this man over here is going to be a tough task by right. defenders. And I have instructed my boys, the forwards, to put more pressure on the goal. So at least if we concede, we can score more than what we concede. Okay. So do you have any kind of particular strategy to control uh, Anthony down? Or do you feel like this is something that's going to have to be a free Yeah, I mean, it's when you see him on the field, you have to control him down. You have to try to shut him down as much right. as we can right. with our defenders if you want him to stop scoring. But then, then it's football again, you know? and it's his talent. Right. What can you say? Yeah. Thanks. What do you have to say about this game? Looking forward to it. Um, obviously, I've been out a long time with my knee. Right. Uh, last game I played, I wasn't 100% fit, but I still won. Right. Okay. Right. Yeah. Much better. I've had right. two weeks of rehabilitation, two weeks of more training, right. two weeks to get better, so I feel good. So sharp. Do you feel that uh, this is going to be a game where you're going to have to like probably control yourself as well in terms of yellow cards because of the last few games? No, not really. You think it'll be fine? I just think if I do what I do, I get on with what I do. It just seems to be problems when. Everyone else gets involved and I get involved as well. So, okay. I don't get involved, they don't get involved. It's just friendly competition. Of right? course. It's always friendly on the pitch. It's always friendly off the pitch. All the pitch is different. It's competitive. Of course it I want to win, they want to win. Right. Everybody wants to win. But off the pitch, it's all fine. It's always friendly, it's always amicable. Okay, so let me ask you guys. So, of course, this is a major game for both of you. Alright, Gaurav, you have to win this. Finally, you definitely have to win this. Because you guys have just had a resurgence, you're kind of coming back into the whole thing. Um, what do you feel like the first goal sets it to a game? Yeah, it definitely puts a pressure on the other team, whoever scores first. And then you come back from that, I think, uh, like if you see the history of it, yeah, it's hard. The goals are small. There's not that many goals in the game, so you score a goal. It's a huge one. And then you can defend easier, right? You can close the game up a little bit. Very excited to see this. Let's get some predictions. Orderly predictions. We need to win, so I predict as we need. Natasha. Two nil. Two nil. Alright, 2 0. Goro, that's that. That has to go through him then, right? Yeah. Uh, I'm giving some pressure now to I'm gonna, I'm, gonna go, I'm gonna go for 2 0 to Life Pools. 2 0 to Life Pools. Who do you think from Life Pools and Emma's going? Uh, I fancy Annie to pick up one, Rex right. to pick up the other. Right. Uh, but I don't really care who's going to Do you feel that this is going to be a complete clean sheet for you guys? Look, I set up to try and do what I can do, and that's obviously keep a clean sheet. Uh, the boys up top have to do what they're, what they're good at. You know, most of the time, if you realise I'm actually without X being around, we go one nil down, so I've conceded that one goal, and then I find myself having to try and do the offensive work. Right. And then that's when we leak the goals, the second and the third. Right. So that we will concede a goal. I'm sure that can happen without a right. doubt. But my, I always go into a game first and foremost, I'm trying to concede. Right. The, rest, the rest is up to this big man up there. All right, a lot of pressure on Pex here. Huh? Just got to do what he's got to do. He's a marquee player, probably in my opinion, the best player in the league. Without a shadow of a doubt. What about Nishant? What about Nishant? Uh, <laughs> for me, in my personal opinion, him, him, listen, Nishant, I don't believe can turn a game. All right? I think he can. If we're one down, his presence on the field can flip the game in our Absolutely. favor. I haven't seen Nishant do that 
very often. This season, the Sharks played three games. They've, they've actually uh, drawn two and lost one. Right. Right. Anthony Pecora has played two games and won one button. So as far as I see it, he's, a bit, he's the best player. A lot of pressure on the superheroes. It obviously seems that history has yeah. gone the light blue way when Texas is playing with them. So you guys are going to have to do something really special to pull this down. Yeah. We will work with our minds. All right. Well, good luck, guys. Work with mine as well. Good luck, keep some pressure here. Good luck, guys. Good luck, guys. Have a great game. Have a great game. Thank you so much. Hi, welcome to Roots TV. I'm here with the Bombay Daredevils and Bandra FC. So guys, you're playing each other tonight. You guys are coming off an epic match last week, I feel. You played so well. Did we? Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Football club Bandra, it's all a little erratic, but uh, we do try it and uh, hopefully we keep entertaining. Yeah, no, I think you had a great game last week. And so what do you think worked for you? Uh, a little bit of luck and hard work and then over the course of 14 weeks it should all click through. It's all coming together now. Because yeah, I mean it's an amateur league, no one is here as professional, so what will happen is I feel that you know, as long as you put in a hard work every time, you should get enough good results. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. And you guys, how do you feel going into today's match? <laughs> we are the teams which has nothing to lose. So <laughs> yeah. we are absolutely chill. We're going to take it game by game now actually. Honestly, the only way we're going to go top is some team eventually loses out. So we're chilled about it. We've done our basic stuffs right. We're missing Nish again. Yeah, but that's Nish. about it. Last week my game was stellar, even though I wasn't here. But I just thought my <laughs> performance was pretty high. Your hard, absence yeah. was felt, really. Was felt. But the week before, also you guys had a really great game. I feel, and um, you know, yeah, it's all coming together now. It's moving forward. I think in the right direction for you guys. What are you changing up this week, though, Sinister? So you've got a couple of players missing. Absolutely nothing. <laughs> yeah, <I> mean, <laughs> we might change up a few things, but it's probably going to be what the same the thing. Keeping the formation. Tactics. Same? I don't know what that means. Uh, it's the same thing. We are waiting for <laughs> Sand to give us an assist, which may happen on the 56th minute. Yeah, probably. maybe. <laughs> maybe, maybe. <laughs> so, so. I'm feeling in good form today. Yeah. I know. <clears throat> good, fantastic. Like, like every Wednesday, yeah. <laughs> the eyes are all going to be on some kid shy as oh, it right. is on the game. He's the one who floats. That's true, that's true. I mean, he's our, key, yes. he's our key player. If, if we hold him back, we may have a chance. Marky one player. Marky one, but I believe like everything's about the squad. That's why Samkit here is very happy to start on the bench and uh, know that it's, you know, it's a team effort. Let some of yeah. the others step up. That's yeah, for sure. I mean, we have, uh, we have, we have San, a few more. Do the same thing. <clears throat> San also left. just decided he's going to sit on the bench <laughs> on that note yeah, on and let note. the team take it forward. <laughs> yeah. That's what I normally do, but <laughs> but we uh, we it's don't have any bench. place to lose at this time. We have to win everything. So yeah. we're going to give it our all and uh, fight right till the end. And have fun out there. Okay. Yeah. I don't know about that today, but mostly give it our all. I think it's going to be a good game between the two of you. I think it's going to be a yeah. really, really nice I'm, game I'm, to watch. I'm personally a little yeah. concerned about the next season starting in summer. Uh, I feel it's <laughs> Should we focus on today's hard. game? Let's get right. to a side note. <laughs> <laughs> season six. Uh, a <laughs> <laughs> little concerned about side season Side note, happy. <laughs> yeah. Okay, cool, guys. Well, all Fantastic. of you, best thank of you, luck. Um, you. You're most welcome. Good luck today, guys. It's a lovely thank, you. thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Not play thank this you. season. Play next season. <laughs> you heard it here Provided first. You make Come the on. cut. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. Thank Good you. luck. <laughs> thank you. Good evening and welcome to Roots TV. We are here, game week nine, sitting here with uh, Uday Jhala, manager for Squadron FC, and Karan Shankar, the leading goal scorer for the Vikings. Very excited to have you guys here. Um, Claire, why don't you welcome these two guys in? So, what Thank do you, you feel about um, today's match? What are you going to do? You were all really the good Avengers, the Avengers. We, we've got so. uh, a result to avenge. 4 0 last time, just took a drubbing. I think we have a point to prove. Wow. I've, I've been to many of the Vikings' homes and I've seen a calendar up and the big red circle around this date because they were waiting for this. Uh, well, you know what? We were, we were. I, I, I have to really point something out. In the beginning of the season, we asked everybody, and I have this on tape and I have it recorded. That we asked everybody who are your top four predictions, who are your bottom four predictions. The Vikings ended up in the top four. Squadron literally ended up in the bottom two, specifically. And in game week nine, specifically, Squadron sits second in the table. Second in the table. They could drop to seventh. Too. All right. And Vikings currently are. Yeah. doesn't count for too much right now. <laughs> table doesn't count too much. So yeah. tight. It's too tight. So we're going to leave that there. Also, and Squadron's a phenomenal team, no doubt. They've got players, but. Uh, yeah, today is the day where we test those players. Fire up. Do you have a full squad today? Fully. We're in. We're in yeah. to win it. Squadron? Well, if this interview goes on for half an hour longer, we might get Silesh on time because he's still at work right now. It's very unlikely. <laughs> We're happy to give you five minutes, but I'm not sure. Very unlikely. Happy. <laughs> very unlikely. 
But guys, let, let me ask you guys. So nine nine weeks in, how do you think everything has progressed in the tournament so far? There have obviously been a lot of like ups and downs, fights, good moments, bad moments. What do you guys think so far? Overall, it's been a fantastic experience. It's a long, tough, arduous season, and it is difficult to get your team. Oh, that's, a, that's crazy. You have to keep that sort of motivation and that sort of fighting spirit to come every week. But everybody brings it, and you can see the way everyone works so hard on the field. Um, it's been a great league so far. Yeah. And you can see by how tight the table is, but how it's well managed the sides are, and how well put together this entire operation. Everybody's yeah, exactly. Taking it very seriously. Do we remember that? Far too seriously. It's just for fun. Yeah, I know. I think we take it. For At Jala's fun. age, this stuff is uh, takes a toll. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. Uh, <laughs> I've aged yeah, but it's, it's a phenomenal league, league, and I think we all look forward to this week in, week out, and. Let's do this. What's going to happen? Shank, no, but Shanks have seen when his team wins, he's all pumped. He's like, when his team loses, he's like, I don't really care about the team. Uh, <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe that could be his coping mechanism. Yeah, yeah I know. Is that, that your coping mechanism? Is it? Is it? Um, <laughs> I don't know. Favorite Possibly. moment of the league? I don't know if there's a moment, but probably when I was goalkeeping against Django and I let in two in the first 10 minutes and I wanted the ground to follow me whole. <laughs> and each one of my teammates didn't look at me or say a word, didn't have anything negative to say. Just, just like in life. Upon themselves, got together and recovered. Just like all your friends in life. Basically, pretty <laughs> Basically. much my life. Yeah. What life in you? ten What's minutes. Your favorite, favorite moment. I think there've been a lot of favorite moments, it but have to be uh, involving you. I mean, I suppose moments. no. I think our most charged up moment has been our comeback victory against Dead Devils, who've yeah. been on the rise. Yeah. But we just lost to these guys 4 nil. So the next game is important. We pick it up. So definitely that last minute free kick. So what are you guys gonna do when there is no football to play for like months? Come to your house <laughs> and uh, eat DC double A. In a strange kind of way, I'm kind of looking forward to the off season just to de stress. <laughs> yeah, it's we true. Evaluate everything. Really play. I do yeah, second that. I do. Still, we still get a regular. But does that mean that you're not you you you're okay not playing in this next season after that? No 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 no, <laughs> no, no not at all. Let's not get just looking forward to traveling, <laughs> not <laughs> from Wednesday to Wednesday or Tuesday <laughs> night to Tuesday <laughs> night. I want to go for ten days. But the thing is, the way the quality is increasing, I, I'm not going to get into the team next season. So I'm just going to be a non-playing manager. Well, very excited to see what happens in the next few weeks. Uh, excited to see what happens in the next season as well. But more so, really looking forward to how you guys play in the upcoming game. Shank's prediction today? Yes, some predictions. Uh, I think it's going to be a tight one. I'm not going to jinx it with a prediction. <laughs> oh. Yeah. I, I, I can, I, I've had this sort of recurring vision of a Shank's top corner goal. So I know that's happening. But in and around that, I'm not sure what else. That's what I think it's going to be a is. very, very tight Shanks game. Shanks is going to slam one perler in the top corner. Quadrin, I his own goal though. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's going to be tight. It's going to be tight. Uh, these guys are, are clowns, but they're very skillful clowns. I like well, Quadrin. I'm I'm, I can tell you honestly, everybody on the field and everybody outside the field is definitely looking forward to it. So good luck today, and we'll see how it happens. Okay? Thank you guys. Thank you so okay, much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, thank you, buddy. Guys. Thank you. I'm here with Bay City and Django Unchained and um, we're looking forward to an amazing match tonight. I think it's going to be really tight and very exciting. We're here, Bay City is top of the table right now, so we've got a lot to lose guys. Yep. Is that how we'll you try feel? And, or? We'll try and stay on top, let's see what happens. we got a team back again yep. and hopefully we should try and at least scrape through here. Full squad tonight? Yep, nearly, nearly the full squad okay. except... I'm you're out. Manager. You're out tonight. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. So are you changing up the formation then? If you don't have a answer. No, yeah. I, it'll be pretty much the same. Yeah. It's be, it's number one versus number two. So it's going to be very interesting and yeah. very tight. Yeah, very it close. is. It's going to be. A they've got a good game. Very exciting game tonight, I think. Yeah. So what's your plan for tonight's game? Oh, uh, we're missing a few players. Okay. We've always missed a few players. Um, yeah. So we, we've done a bit of strategizing on how we're going to work against Space City FC. Yeah. And uh, we have a plan. We're going to stick to it and let's see how it goes. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. So, guys, we are nine weeks into the um, league, I think. And so, what do you feel about the entire concept? Like Double how? game week this week. Yeah, it is. It's yeah. a it's a tough week, I think. It's going to be on Friday. Everybody's going to be quite tired, I think. And. Um, it's going to be a really important match on Friday, I think. Absolutely. And um, so, what do you think about the whole concept of the league? Like, how are you enjoying being part of this Wednesday night football, this ritual that we have every week? It's great, it's fun, people are getting together, having a great time. Yeah. Um, 
looking at some good football being played. Yeah. Uh, some squabbles, some good times. Let's see how it happens. <laughs> yeah. I look, I look forward to Wednesdays. Every Wednesday, yeah. it's a favorite day of my week. That's awesome. That's so yeah, most awesome. Most productive day of the week. <laughs> it's, <laughs> absolutely. Most, it's only football. Absolutely. It's only about football. Yeah. Yeah. Just pre-chilling, watching a game and post-chilling. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, basically. And a lot of, lot of um, banter on the Roots group chat, I think. Always. Absolutely. Always. <laughs> Especially on Wednesdays. What's your highlight of the league so far? Highlight of the league so far? For us? Yeah. I mean, if it can be anything. A, a, a match you've leading. watched or... Yeah, the leading. Yeah, I, I, I was just telling him that uh, probably my the best game our team has played is against Squadron, where we beat them 4-2. And yeah. I mean, that was, they played really well. 4-1. 4-2, I think. They scored 2. You guys yeah. have had some really good games, though. I mean, you've, you've been strong all the way through. I mean, from Last the very... Last two games, we've been a little wobbly, but it's okay. Uh, Pickups are there throughout. Yeah. So. So it's we had a, most of the squad season. not playing. Exactly. Yeah. Last, last game we three games. Yeah. yeah. But now we're back and we've got a marquee yeah. one to play. I was going to say Sam is back today yeah. as well. Yeah. So. He's nice and fit. Yeah. Yeah. Right. yeah. First <laughs> game off. <laughs> <laughs> the last time he was played so was so against them. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. 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 Well, it's good to hear you guys have a full squad. Like, you know. <laughs> and who are you, who are you missing tonight? Though, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I've been through that. That's fine. Yeah. No, we're ready. We're excited. It's going to be a good game. Yeah. yeah. High energy, full power tonight, no? Always, Absolutely. Always. Absolutely. Excellent. Yeah. Excellent. Well, good luck tonight, both Cheers. of you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you so Thank much you. for your time. You too. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck, guys.